My hands pluck the things I know that I'll need I take the sugar and butter from the pantry I add the flour to begin But I am hoping to start And then it's down with the recipe And bake from the heart as a director, I often think about every show I make as a meal. So I do think very much of that metaphor of a cook, and often when you when you make a meal for a friends, because I do, uh, as a director, think about the audience all the time, and I think about what do they want, what do I want to put in, what are the ingredients I want to put in to this meal, and, and I'm very eager to see that response when people taste it for the first time. So this, this metaphor of, of thinking about the audience, thinking about um, a loved one that you make a precious meal for, um, is very much how we think about theater. So somewhere I'm a cook, not just with food. Okay, for those of you who haven't seen it, uh, of a, a waitress who puts all of her emotions into the pie she bakes. And she's an extraordinary pie baker, and of course what she needs to learn is that uh, sometimes you can't put it all in the pie. You can't tuck everything in the pie and you have to deal with your life. And that's sort of the journey that she goes through in the show. Um, but the journey with pie has been a deep one. Um, we added a lot more pie on Broadway. Uh, the, the prosceniums that have all those pies, that was a new idea. Um, we tried to get aroma things going on at ART and they have these commercials, things you can get from movie theaters. You know, and we bought the apple pie aroma scent. It smelled horrible, so we couldn't use it. And um, Barry Weissler was so determined to have aroma, I think you all know this, that we bake a pie every night in the lobby of the Brooks Atkinson. So there's this very like poor theater. It's a little convection oven like the size of it like sits on a box like this. It's in a black box. And we have a pie delivered every night with extra sugar and cinnamon, and it goes in the convection oven and it bakes and it smells through the pre-show, the intermission, and when you leave. And the funniest thing is, um, you know, Barry was so excited about this when we first did it, and I was in the corner of the Brooks Atkinson lobby, very, as you all know, very, very small theater, and I said, but Barry, who eats the pot? I mean, what, you know, every night we're cooking them, I said, oh, no, Diane, you can't eat it. It's like, too much sugar and cinnamon. And then he walked away, and then the head usher tapped me. She said, we eat it every night. <laughs> Sure, are doing just well with that bite right now.